Good evening, family. This is Linda. I hope you're having a wonderful day today. Today's Thanksgiving Day. Happy Thanksgiving to you all. I hope you all are having a great day today. So today in this video, I would like to share with you all the Arabica and what I discovered in my own plants. I didn't know, y'all. I didn't know, but I figured it out. I figured it out. So today I'm going to share it with you. But first, if you are not subscribed to the channel, hit the subscribe button. I will be sharing my zone nine garden. Yay! 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 <laughs> Let's get on with the video. <laughs> Good morning, family. This is Linda. So this is where I harvest yesterday. These are the tech saws that I harvested. Yeah, they looking fine this morning. Yeah. Tech saws. They are so good. <laughs> yep. I ate some last night. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, but I want to welcome you all. Um, today is Thursday. Yeah, it's Thanksgiving Day, you all. I hope you and your family have a wonderful day. Yeah. Look at this mama. She bloomed this morning. Good morning, baby. And there's more coming. Look, they're just... They're getting ready. They're getting ready to have a show. Yeah. I'm for it. Yeah. <laughs> Today, I want to talk to you all about an Arabica coffee plant. And what I discovered with my plant. Yeah. This is an Arabica. Let me share what I discovered today. <laughs> so this is my um, coffee plant in. She's under the um, plantain. Yeah. So here is the plantains. And she is under here. So I wanted to see this. When I pulled uh, these uh, little seedlings out from this coffee plant, I noticed something else. So look at this. There is a lot more little seedlings in here, right? So I'm going to see if I can get some of them, get more out with roots on them. That's what I'm looking for. Boom. Look at that, y'all. So they already have roots. That's so cool. Roots. So that's two. Wow, y'all. So evidently, they started this plant from seed. And they just put a bunch of seeds in here. Yeah. And this is what you get. Boom. Look at that. There's many more. Let me just try to get the small one. Boom. <laughs> That's crazy. All right, so the bigger ones, I'm going to let them stay. But there's about three more that if I really wanted them, I could get them. And still, there's three big ones, you know, that that's cool to the plant. Let's go put them in the pot. All right, so I have soil mixed in this big 17-gallon container, but check it out, y'all. So, um, that don't look deep enough. Wow, this is so cool. So really, I can end up with about five or six <laughs> um, coffee plants. So, 
in order to have a uh, a good harvest of of uh, of coffee beans, uh, it is suggested that you that you have more than one plant. Well, we got it, y'all. We got more than one plant. So this is so cool. The wonderful thing is that the plant, fourteen ninety nine, guys, and we are going to have some great coffee plants. So if you if you missed that video, I got another one. I got to get another cup. Hold on. All right. So here's my other cup. I'm just going to fill them up with soil. Yeah. But anyway, um, if you if you have not seen that video of when I purchased this coffee plant, it is an Arabica coffee plant. And so... I seen uh, my beautiful family, uh, the Grow Family Network, the Grow Family Network. I was watching his unboxing of some trees that he purchased. Now, my nephew Chris over there at Back to Our Roots Home says we had we had been talking about uh, coffee plants and that how we wanted to grow coffee plants in the spring of 2022, right? So I was sitting there watching the Grow Family Network. He got this plant. He was so excited to get it, right? He was excited. And it was the Arabica coffee plant. That's that's what he purchased. So that sent me on a frenzy again <laughs> to find this tree. So I went to uh, this nursery here in my area. So if you are from New Orleans and this was in, this store is in Marrero, right? It's in Marrero on the West Bank Expressway. It is called Rose Garden Center. Rose Garden Center had, they had about 12 um, coffee plants. And when I grabbed the tag, the tag says Arapica. And then I looked at the price and it said $14.99. I'm like, give me that thing. <laughs> I was so excited. And of course, uh, my my nephew over there back to our roots home said he was so excited. You know, so of course, yes, I sent him one. Yes, I sent him one. So he's excited about that too. So, so now, not counting the big one out there, I have, this is five plants i have two more in containers like this and i have a cutting man i'm gonna have a coffee field over here right <laughs> but i'm excited so now i'm just gonna give them mm -hmm, y'all know <laughs> i'm gonna give them all some 511 this morning yeah that's what i'm gonna do i know uh yeah I'm going to share with you what I do from experience, not from what somebody said, not from what I read, but from experience. And from my experience, 511 have never, ever killed a plant. She have nothing inside of her that will kill nothing. But anyway, do your own research on what type of fertilizers you want to use in your garden. Do your research, man. Do your research. Yeah. All right, family, there they are. So I'm going to sit them over here <laughs> by the mother plant. Yeah. Let's see what they do. I hope you all have a beautiful, beautiful day this Thursday. Enjoy your family and your loved ones. Yeah, just have a great day. Today, I'm going to go over by, by my little sister, Jada, Jody, and I. We're going to go over there by my little sister and hang out with 
her and my nieces. We're going to watch the Saints game and hopefully we get a win. <laughs> Later, family. Mm-hmm.